Hello and welcome to this week's match highlights on Montrose FC TV with myself, Stephen Dixon. This week's match highlights comes from Saturday's match in the SBFL League 1 at Lynx Park between Montrose and East Fife. Montrose coming into this one in the last five games are starting to pick up three victories, one draw and a defeat, scoring ten and conceding seven in the process. You know, at least five, their last run of five games have started to pick up three victories, one draw and a defeat, scoring nine and conceding six in their run of five. The last five head-to-heads between the pair, I saw two victories each and a draw, dating back all the way back to February 2016. So the man in the middle is David Dickinson, and he will be responsible for all footballing matters. The trolls get us underway and straight away it's out. The trolls have it at the back again. It's launched forward though by Ian Campbell. And now the trolls are going to make something happen. Craig Johnston sees his effort blocked by Brett Long. For his five. Now, good hold up play here from the visitors. He's five dressing the away kit of. Red and white, here's a chance, great save that from Alan Fleming. It's five denied, the shot coming in from Scott Linton. Now here is Montrose, it's Martin Rennie inside the East Fife box. Tees it off and it's back. It's digged in there by Harrington. Still out wide right, it's knocked back in, there's a chance. Since well held by the goalkeeper, Ewan Henderson, it was who lobbed it back in. Someone throws in a traditional all blue kit with the white socks. Dunsmore knocks that out wide right now. Good defending though by Ewan Henderson. And throws find themselves in a pucker. Liam Callahan's given the ball, he has a chance for East Fife, but it went tamely back into Alan Fleming's hands. Alan Fleming dressed in all red. It was a fluorescent hint to it. And he gets that ball over the halfway line. When throws are going to have to try and deal with this. Sean Dillon. Oh, it's a slack back pass. He has a chance. Oh, and it's wide. Anton Dowds it was. Bearing in on goal. Alan Fleming certainly narrowed the angle. It's a mighty relief in Montrose defence. Now here is Johnston, lays it back to Masson, right foot shot, well wide. And he's going to hunt for the opener. Still deadlock to be broken. Now that's knocked inside from Liam Watt. Now here's Anton Dowds, still Anton Dowds. Ian Campbell slides in back to Liam Watt. Here's a shot and it's in the net! And it's first blood to the visitors. Liam Watt dinks the ball beyond. Alan Fleming, and on 25 minutes, it's the Fifers who strike first. 1 0. And here is Montrose with a chance, and it's well wide in the end. Did take a deflection on its way through from Rennie. Now Dylan knocks the ball on to Ian Campbell. Campbell knocks it on to Steves. Now he's dispossessed and East Fife looking to counter. Good play in the middle of the pack. Ball's knocked on. There's the one, two. And it's back with Ross Davidson. And here's another chance. It's what? And it's a double. Good through ball from Ross Davidson. And Liam Watt puts East Fife two up. 40 minutes on the clock. And that's half time at Lynx Park. Montrose now East Fife two. Liam Watt with a double on 25 and 40 minutes respectively. That's Liam Watt's third goal in 24 appearances. In from Method. Now here's Anthony Atsi, the one alone. Aberdeen youngster, left foot shot! Great save! Stunning save from Brett Long. Former kick to Montrose. Ian Campbell with a delivery. Oh, it's just wide from Sean Dillon. And a chance goes a begging. David Endes to try and get back into this one. Free kick launch forward. Picked up far left. Here's Steves. 
onto the right foot, gets the delivery in. Yeah. As far as Ian Campbell, who knocks the ball out wide or right. On to Chris Antoniazzi, threads her inside to Marson, and there's Rennie, great defending there from East Fife. The slight challenge was so crucial there from Mark Doherty. Throwing for East Fife, Craig Watson. Throws that inside, there's a chance to left foot shot just over the top there from the number 10, Kevin Smith. Now he's five looking to make it away, but that's cut out though now. Dylan has it for Montrose. Threads it inside for Anthony Atze. Now Rennie with a left foot shot where he throws it wide. Ball kick, he's five. Now throwing far side, Anthony Atze for Montrose. Thinks that on to. Craig Johnston, Johnston wins the ball back at the second attempt, it's going to be a chance here and the shot comes in there from Jimmy Redman, good save Brett Wong. Now, Anthony Atze gets her into the mixer, but Montrose can't make anything happen and now it's Fife looking to break away, Mark Doherty knocks the ball out, far left to Watson, but now Montrose win the ball back and again it's Doherty, plays the ball back, he's dispossessed and now Montrose it's good play, Josh Skelly tries to get it across and it's on to Rennie, back to Skelly Skelly goes left to Steve Steve's with a shot, charge down though and out for a corner block it was from Chris Kane and Montrose starting again at the back He's five. The ball back. Going out to the number six, Craig Watson. Knocks it down the right hand side. Kyle Bell. He's away from Campbell. Knocks that back. Here's a great chance. Oh, and it's side netting. Side netting from Kevin Smith. Glorious chance for a former Dundee United striker. Ian Campbell to deliver. Toss. Left foot from a fourth man gets her into the box, it's headed away and it's going to be dealt with far side from the double goal scorer Liam Watt. Well, in actual fact, he's given away the throw into Montrose again on the far side. Throwing going to come in long into the box, headed on by Redman, away by Megat, still. Montrose keep the move alive, Anthony Atze headed away, still. And throws have it, and there's a shot by Redman. It's blocked, and it's away again there by Mike Watson, and back in by Steves. That's it. As referee David Dickinson calls time on what it turned out to be a tough 90 minutes from and throws. They ended up losing to a double by Liam Watt, both in the first half. Goals on 25 and 40. So Liam Watt. Of course, bang in goals number two and three this season since signing for East Fife from Brecon in the summer. But at full time, when Montrose got one eye on the Scottish Cup tie next weekend against Dundee United. It's finished at Lynx Park, Montrose nil, East Fife two.